breaking news. Reports have been coming in all over the state of Florida of a mysterious Zoom virus. University of Florida scientists suspect this may be the first case of a computer virus transmission to humans. Caroline joins us live from the scene of one of the local reports in Mariana. Yes, Terry. I've come to the source of the first cases reported in the Panhandle at the Jackson County Extension Office here in Mariana. I'm here with County Extension Director Doug Mayo to find out more about the situation. Mr. Mayo, can you briefly summarize what you've observed? This has been a very stressful period all across the world. In the beginning, I just thought what we were observing was normal stress in the employees as more details of COVID-19 were shared each week. Over time, I started realizing though this was not something that I had seen, and it wasn't just stress and shock, but something much more troubling. So what specifically have you noticed over the past six weeks uh, with employees at the Extension Service? Okay. Early in March, as we learn more about the pandemic, employees just look stunned and overwhelmed. I thought it was just information overload from the ever-changing instructions, but I started to notice the employees were getting short-tempered and testy. There were so many changes in instructions with wash hands every hour, sanitize, uh, hand sanitizer, cancel meetings, stop travel, lock the doors, limit to 50 people, then 10. Uh, then go home, it was a stressful and crazy time. Well, a lot of us were stressed and crazy during those first few weeks. How was what you saw different? Yes, this has certainly been a stressful time, uh, but this is also about the time that we started all those Zoom meetings. There were statewide leadership meetings, then regional, then county, even staff meetings with people working from home. Then came the shift to changing the way we do business. No in-person meetings, avoiding public contact, only interacting through multiple Zoom computer meetings each day over and over. There were state, regional, county, team, staff meetings, and even county level uh, staff meetings and people working from home. My staff started getting withdrawn, frustrated, and then strangely quirky. One of the strangest things was they all kept humming and singing this crazy song. I think it's the theme song from a 70s show on PBS. Zoom, zoom, zoom a zoom? This is when I suspected something else was wrong. So what did you do about this? So I did what we've been trained at the University of Florida. I contacted the experts uh, and had them come up. They sent Dr. Ethan Carter, a leading expert in technologically induced psychological conditions from Shams to do an evaluation. He's still here working with our employees. So I've asked him to share a few things with you. Dr. Carter, can you give us an overview of what you've learned thus far? Multiple staff evaluations have revealed that the virus has affected 90% of employees at the Jackson County Extension Office. The only employee that appears unaffected at this point is the maintenance technician, who has very limited co computer screen requirements. At this point, in our observations, it seems that millennials are at the highest risk for the Zoom virus infection. We suspect this is because they have more time each day interacting with technology and screens. At this point, there is no vaccine or treatment other than isolation from technology. People need to utilize proper PPE and limit screen times no more than two hours per day with sessions limited to 30 minutes each. People need to get outside, interact with real people, and get back to task with tangible results. Mr. Mayo, one final question. How has this Zoom virus infect affected your staff after being exposed for the past six weeks? The primary issue is the employees are dazed and distracted, unable to focus on important tasks. They hum or sing that crazy song. They per prefer to stay isolated from others. They can't concentrate. And the Zoom meetings are, are just ongoing, and it seems the infection just keeps getting worse and worse each week. Terry, 
Terry, this situation has been reported all over Florida, but as you have seen, nowhere in the state is it more serious than right here in Jackson County. But I have to admit, that crazy song is sort of catchy. Zoom, 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 zoom. Morning, zoom.